Whoa! That's quite the location for a house, Mikey. Right? It's so hot here! Hot, hot, hot! Look! It looks toasty. Another house. That could be fun. What's up? Mikey, isn't your nether house a little too hot? It's right by a sea of lava. Wait, you even have your furnace running. Right. How about we build a secret nether hideout? I'd like that. Still, the nether is terribly hot. So I think we should make a refreshing secret hideout that's cool and full of greenery. Can you make a cool place here? Of course we can. Let's give it a shot. Now where should we build it? Oh, Mikey, what if we build an under lava secret hideout? What? Is that even possible? I'm sure it'll be fine. Just watch. For now, let's dig under the lava here. Here? Huh? It can be done. Watch. Oops, I fell. Hmm. Mikey, let's block off the ceiling. Okay. Yeah. Not bad. Okay, now Mikey, let's carve out this area. This will be where we'll make the secret hideout. Under a sea of lava. That's it? Thanks! Wow! Wow, your area feels cooler already. It changed completely. Totally. Let's make wood floors. Sounds good! I'm specifically using birch wood. Birch wood is very white. That should make it feel cooler. Yep! All right. Filling this in. And now to fill in the ceiling. I'm using these blocks to do the ceiling. All right. There, much better. Oh, it's much nicer now, but not perfect. Now let's build the entrance. How about a staircase? You can't tell it's under lava. Nope. Looks like this will work. Awesome! Nice job! All right! Hmm. Cool! Okay. Fantastic! How's this look? Good! Excellent! The ladder's done, and so is the entrance. There's something we still need, though, Mikey. What? Our idea was to build a cool house in the nether, right? So, I think we should add some greenery. All right! That's why I'm going to make the staircase much fancier. What's that mean? First, I'll use some dirt. What could be more natural than dirt? Like this. Fabulous! There. And on the side of the dirt, I'll place birch trap doors. Like this. Okay. And now I'll plant some trees. To do that, I'll use some oak leaves and oak fence. Okay. Like this. Maybe every other one? Mm. Now that's nice. Very natural. Now, the plan is for this area to be the living room. I want to make it very extravagant. Hmm. Let's put some lights on the ceiling. I'll use beacons. They're really bright. Yep, extremely bright. I knew that. Wow! Here? And here? Okay. Now, lava makes the nether very hot, right, Mikey? So, what would you like to do when you come home? What? I don't know. The answer is swim. I know I'd want to take a dip, so let's build a pool. We'll make it in the living room. This can be the pool area. All right, let's make it nice and wide. Wow, awesome. A pool in the nether, under a sea of lava? Yep. Amazing. It's incredible. I brought the bucket. Go for it! Two at once! 
ready! Sure! This'll be a moment to remember! Three, two, one! Huh? The water is staying! You try, JJ! Here! I remember now. You can't place water in the nether. Any water you place evaporates. So, no pool? Actually, I know a secret way to make water here. There's a secret way to use water in the nether? Watch. How? I'll use commands. It's simple. Type set block. Set block. Then, squiggle, 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 water. And that's it. That's how to make water in the nether. Now, let's light up the pool, Mikey. We can use sea lanterns for it. Whoa, that looks like fun. You can really swim in it. Who would have thought we could swim in the nether? <laughs> yeah, wow. Yep, looks like fun. Lanterns here and here. Okay, now let's make a place to eat in the pool. Fancy. Something like this where we can sit in the pool. How is it possible for a pool to be this fancy? Done. This is the table. We can sit and soak while we eat. The nether is really hot, so we can cool off down here. Perfection! The pool's finished. Next up, the living room. I want to make it feel like one. Maybe a table and a sofa? We need a kitchen, too. How's this? Another lantern here. Whoa, that's a pretty shade of green. It feels natural, too. Is this good? Our house looks really fancy. Fancy, fancy, fancy! Whoa! Fancy! This is really cool. Let's do the kitchen now. Shall we put it over here? I made a spot for it here. Over here? Well, are those grass blocks? Yep. Okay, now to till all the soil. We're so fast! You bet. What should we plant, Mikey? Watermelons? Yeah! Watermelons and carrots. Okay. Watermelons first. This is our line of watermelons. This is carrots. And this is the weed area. Nice job. Thanks. Oh, a watermelon already grew. All right. Carrots, wheat, and watermelons. I think we've done pretty well for ourselves. Let's put our finished crops here. All that's left now is the bedroom. Mikey, what should we do? We could build it over here. I was thinking under the staircase. That works too. Let's sleep there. If you sleep in a bed in the nether, it'll explode. So let's build them out of wool. Mine will be here. I made a pillow out of snow. Amazing! Maybe a bit bigger? I like to read in bed, so I'll put a bookshelf here too. Whoa! Perfect! Okay. This house is amazing. It really is fantastic. We forgot about the kitchen. Let's make one. Yeah. Okay, a cauldron right here. Oh, you can still put water in the cauldron, even in the nether. Apparently. Now for a faucet and a furnace. Okay, finished. Fabulous. Oh, and the fridge. Nice. Okay, now we're done. We're done! Now we can show off our super cool, fancy, secret nether hideout. Let's start outside. This is how it looks from the outside. It's right in the middle of a sea of lava. You can open it from the inside too. This button lets you inside. We're in. Once you're inside, you're on a staircase. It's lined with trees, lots of greenery. It feels so cool inside. And now, the living room. The table is made from wood. It's nice. Mm-hmm. And this is our pool. We use commands to put water in the nether. We can go for a swim whenever we want. Oh, an apple? We can eat here. Yep, while we're chilling in the pool. Oh, thanks. Just gonna eat apples while cooling down in the pool. And once you're tired, you can sleep in a poolside bed. There's even a bookshelf with books to read. Fantastic! Okay, next up is the kitchen. This is where we can cook. And over here is the farm. We're surprisingly self-sufficient in the nether. This place is so cool, you'd never know you were in the nether. Yeah! Aw, our cat was stuck. Poor kitty! 
Here we have watermelons, carrots, and wheat. And all of our harvested crops go in here. How's that for the best secret hideout in all the nether? Today, we built a secret hideout in the nether. It's cool with plenty of greenery. If you enjoyed today's video, please be sure to like and subscribe to the channel. Bye 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 Hey! Mikey! Huh? Uh... Huh? Hey! What's up? Wanna come inside? Mikey, isn't your house a bit much? No! Oh. <laughs> Why are you living somewhere so dangerous? Ow! That's hood! You can barely go inside! It's hard to get inside! It's the ultimate lava house! Be careful, though! It's hot! The entrance looks tricky. So, this lava house. Is the entire house surrounded by lava? Yep! Totally surrounded! Lava is the ultimate home security system. Mikey, you've inspired me. How about we build a lava house together? Oh? A lava house? Sure! I wonder how it'll turn out. Let's build a lava house! Instead of a lava moat, let's build a real house made of lava. Let's go to a nice place to build our lava house. Let's go! How does this area look? It's extremely nice. We even have cows? <laughs> so much nature! Hmm. Awesome! Let's build a lava house! So, let's do this! All right, we'll use a very important item to build our lava house. I'll need to use a special little trick for this. A trick? I have a present for you, Mikey. Everyone at home can try this command as well. Give huh? at a barrier. Barrier? Like so. Ta-da! A barrier block! Check this out! Incredible! You can get it by typing in that command. It's called a barrier block, and it's invisible. Unless you're holding one? Yep. You can only see them when you're holding one. The rest of the time, they're invisible. However, the blocks still exist. Check it out. It looks like I'm hovering. We'll use these to build our lava house. Our house won't be surrounded by lava. It'll be made of lava. We still need to decide where to build it, though. Let's do it here. Well, let's do it. Now another decision. How big shall we make it? Hmm. Hmm. This big? Looks good to me. Yeah, that's probably good. Next up, we'll decide how tall the walls should be. They should be fairly high. Huh? Dirt? A dirt house? That's right, but just watch. How are you gonna make it a lava house? <laughs> huh, that should do it. Okay, I'm going to replace these dirt blocks with barrier blocks, the item I made just a moment ago. The important thing is, don't put barrier blocks in the hole in the ground. Just try to copy what I'm doing. I guess we'll try building it this way. Like this. What are we doing? Basically, we're placing barrier blocks around like this. Okay. Oh, Mikey, good job. This isn't covering the hole, right? Okay. Then we'll make another line on the inside that doesn't cover the hole. That means we need a one block wide gap here. We'll leave a little pathway between the two. Making the inside layer? Hm. Have you figured out what I'm doing, Mikey? No idea. I thought we were making a lava house. But what does that have to do with these barrier blocks? We've actually finished most of the lava house with this. What do you mean? What part of this? You really want to know? I do! In that case, I'll tell you. Mikey, hold some lava. Got it! Next, try pouring it right here. Pour it in all of the gaps? Oh! Go for it, Mikey. Whoa, check it out! What's going on? Whoa! I missed! Duh! That's not good. Huh, that was close. If we mess up, we'll need to redo a large section, so be careful. Like this? That's it. Whoa, very good. Yeah, yeah, looking good. What's going on? Awesome. Shouldn't the lava be flowing over? Well, Mikey, that won't happen here. Let's look at it from farther back once you've finished. What? See that? Incredible! No way! The walls are lava! We made walls out of lava. It's really a lava house. Yeah. Once you take a barrier block out of your hand, it really does look like a lava house. See? I see! It's already a lava house on the inside. There's no entrance. Well, that's true, but we can make one. How about we make it with cobblestone? Hmm? Huh? The entrance will be pretty difficult to build, but I guess it can go here. That's fine. Huh? Huh? That was way too close. Ooh. See what I did? What's 
going on here? I placed the stone blocks quickly. Check it out. Huh? Oh, it's the entrance. The entrance? Oh, and this won't be any old entrance. It'll have a door. This wooden door, uh, wouldn't a wooden door catch on fire? Huh? No good? Let's see if it burns. I don't know. Maybe not. Wow! I'll put it on this side. It's not catching on fire. Let's go with that. Let's do it! Whoa! Fantastic! <laughs> Incredible! You can get inside this way. The entrance is complete. Now, should we build a roof? Let's do the roof! Well, the roof should also be easy enough to build. What should we make the roof out of? For the color, we could... <laughs> Are you okay? I'm okay. Let's use stairs for the roof. Oh, stairs? Here we go. And then... Just like this. Wow! Now, for the last part, how's this? Now, I'll pour lava up here. That way. <laughs> That's gotta be bad! Nah, it's fine. Seriously? Probably. Probably? If I planned it right. Uh, no way! This is turning into a big problem! Whoa! It settled right in! See, Mikey? Haha! <laughs> Still, it's not entirely covered. I'll add some more. Next up, Mikey, let's design the interior. Time for interior design! We went to all that effort of building walls out of lava. So let's make the floor lava, too! Wow! <laughs> well, we dig. Ooh. We'll dig up this layer of the ground. Yikes! Lava's seeping in! A lava floor? How does that work? What can we do with it? First, we'll make the floor out of lava. All right? Just like this. Like that. Ooh. All right, we did it! Hot, hot, hot! <laughs> There's nowhere to escape to in here now. Still, we can't live like this, so let's make it a bit more livable. Let's use a nice white color on the floor. How about some blocks of quartz? Let's place some platforms. Somewhere we can stand. The entrance? Hmm. This is the entrance. Next, let's build a sofa and a television. Okay. Let's put the TV here. Oh? Huh. Let's do the TV. Let's make the television really big. This might be good enough for the TV. Oh. Ah. <laughs> hmm. Oh, good enough. Oh, the TV's finished. <laughs> is that Donkey Kong? We made a TV that we can play Donkey Kong on. Next, the sofa goes here. What? <laughs> you okay, Mikey? Let's build the sofa right here. Let's build the sofa. Now well, this is too close to the TV. Let's move it back. You can't sit too close to the TV. And so, we have a sofa. Let's make it a corner sectional sofa. How's this? Great sofa. Now that's not all, Mikey. We need to build a proper table. A table? In a room this hazardous? A table? It's hot in here, so we can drink some nice cold tea while we play video games. Oh! Ugh, it burned up. Huh, what now? I have an idea! How's this? You're on fire, Mikey! Hot! Oh! -ho. Well? Impressive! Oh, but we can't see the TV all the way. Well, whatever. Should we put it closer? Yeah, let's put it one space closer. Whoa! Fantastic! It's perfect! This is awesome. Check it out. We can watch television while we drink juice. Wow! Okay, our living room is complete. What's next? We'll clear this out. Let's hide our treasure chests in this room. Let's do it! No one will ever find them here! So, once you fall through the lava, let's put an iron trap door up here. Then, by placing the lever here, the lava will stay out of the room. Whoa! That kept the lava out. Whoa! Now let's put out the flames. We'll need to be brave to dive in here. Yikes! This is where we'll put out the flames. After being submerged in lava and catching fire, we'll drop into this pool. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is excellent. Let's put a ladder up that reaches to the top. Hey, Mikey, it's finished. What do you think? It's done? Here we'll have lots of treasure. What should we put inside? It's a secret, JJ. 
Let's fill them with diamonds. Nice! Hmm. Okay, we finished our secret room, which was the last thing we needed to build. This is a secret diamond lair hidden treasure room. Yeah! Let's go back up. Let's go back! Wow! Today, we successfully managed to build a lava house. If you like this video, please be sure to like and subscribe. Thanks so much. Goodbye for now. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay, let's get started. Today, we're playing Minecraft. All right. That sounds totally normal. And super easy. Well, that's because I didn't mention today's mod. It's called the Rising Lava Mod. Did you say rising lava? Yep. That's scary, but I don't see any lava. This mod is actually really harsh. We're going to find out how long we can survive. This looks harmless. There's no sign of danger. How harsh could it be? You can't see it right now, but there's a sea of lava underground, and it's slowly rising to the surface. Whatever. Time to get started. Let's gather up some wood. Sure thing. No problem. Chop that tree. Almost done. I'm gonna cut up this cactus. What are you doing that for? Oh, you know what? Until the lava rises, this is just an ordinary game of survival. Whether or not we hang on depends on the items we collect. Nice, say we gather some food. We can't survive without food. Good idea. Maybe we can find some in a village nearby. If we've got snacks, we're set. I don't think it's that simple. You worry too much, JJ. Hmm. Aren't there any villages in this desert? I mean, there must be. I doubt it. Oh, whoa. Uh, I'm starving. Me too. That's why we have to keep searching. Oh, 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 look. <gasps> a village. We did it. That was easy. I hope there are a lot of people there. Oh, oh no. I'm too hungry to run. We're in the clear. Nice work. Okay, let's start by gathering up some food. Good thinking. Hi, kitty. Hmm? Ah! Chill out, scaredy cat. There's a zombie. What? This whole village must be zombified. That's so unlucky. There still might be some food around. Oh, look. Yay. Hey, Bales. Now we have some food supplies. Let's make some bread. Sure. Baking this close to a zombie is really unsettling. But we've got some grub now, so we're almost good to go. We just need to collect some blocks. Why? We got snacks. We need more than just food. The lava is going to rise, so let's gather up some sand blocks. That way, we'll be able to build our way to higher ground. Relax! Check out the ocean. <laughs> it's beautiful, Mikey, but let's get to work. Uh, fine. Oh, Mikey, lava, look! Huh? No way! I don't believe it! Well, it's clearly lava, but it doesn't seem to be rising. It must have always been here. That's reassuring. No need to rush. We can always run. Just keep digging. This stuff is sure to come in handy. Okay. Mikey, wouldn't you want to use a shovel? Nah, I'm good. You shouldn't slack off. We'll be fine. Uh, I don't see any sign of this lava. <laughs> I wonder when it'll rise. If it does come up, we can just bolt. Piece of cake. Speaking of which, I'm going to harvest some sugar cane. No harm in that, I guess. But what are you going to do with it? Chillax. I suppose the coast is clear for now. Does your mod even work? Ow! Ow! Are you Ow! kidding me? Aww. I'm dead, Mikey. Me too. That happened so fast. Let's try it again. Sure. Wow, Mikey. We lost that round. The lava came out of nowhere and took us both out. This mod is even more challenging than I thought. We've got to get serious. No more goofing off. Get to work. Uh, you were the one fooling around, but whatever. Now we're both focused on the task at hand. That's right. I 
I've already chopped down a tree! Me too! Don't let your guard down! This lava comes out of nowhere! And it's super hard to run away from! I say we do what we did last time and start by searching for a village. Hmm… Oh! There's one! Really? Uh-huh. It's a proper one. No zombies in sight. JJ? Yeah? We can't let our guard down! I'll be careful. I hope we find some iron. We'd have nothing to fear if we had buckets. True! I'll start searching. Hmm, there's food, but no iron. I'm gonna look over here. I'll keep combing through the village. Okay, if I want this bucket, I've gotta go for it. Uh, hey, Mikey, can you focus on gathering up some blocks for us? Sure! There. Could you also make us a furnace? Uh, I can't. I'll handle it. I found some more. It's kind of scary down here. What if the lava comes out of nowhere like it did last time? All right, I think I have what we need. I can make you a bucket too. Thanks a lot, JJ. Keep gathering blocks. Have some food. Thanks, Mikey. Let's get smelting. Are we going to run out of time or what? I'm up on some blocks. Might as well mine these houses. Huh? I think dirt is going to come in handy. Gather up as much as you can. Hmm. Did you see the lava yet? So far, so good! I hope the iron's done. With a bucket of water, we should be able to survive for quite a while. That's right! Here's one. And I filled it up. I'll cut some more trees! Where are you, Mikey? I'm close to where you just were! I've got your bucket! Thanks! This is gonna be easy, but we still can't goof off! Right. Stay focused. The lava will be coming up any minute. Come on. Let's get to higher ground. The reason we failed last time was that we were at too low of an elevation. We'll be safer if we start up here. Mm-hmm. Good thinking. I've really stocked up on blocks. Same. 57 and counting. I wonder if the lava will swallow up the village. That'd be so sad. Maybe it won't strike after all. JJ, keep your guard up. Take this seriously, like me! I don't know. There's no sign of it. Maybe I should head back in the cave. No! Don't! Isn't it worth investigating where the lava is? Well? Ah! What? Oh, it's just a skeleton. Phew! Oh, oh, oh! There it is! Huh? The skeleton's attacking me! But what's worse, the lava's coming! I don't see anything! I told you! Think this is high enough? It's a good start! How's the village so far? I'll be up here! That's high, Mikey. You're really taking things seriously this time. Our water buckets will keep us safe, right? I hope so. Ah! Ah! This is bad! There's nowhere to go! Except up! Ah! Ah! The village is covered! We might be in trouble here, Mikey. Let's keep going up. Uh, JJ, I've only got one left. Uh, Mikey, that's gonna be a problem. Why? Your tower's gonna burn down. <sighs> the village is gone, and I only have 64 blocks of dirt left. Can we even survive this? I still have lots of wood. Oh, wait, don't come any closer. Huh? I'm gonna try dumping some water. Do it. Here goes. What's gonna happen? Do you think this is gonna work? Oh. oh! Oh, check it out! It turned into obsidian! Uh, is my wood on fire? Yep. Ah, what am I gonna do? Hey, Mikey, look! I see the edge of the lava! Huh? We'll make it if we can get over there. But the lava's rising so fast! And I'm out of blocks! Wait, what if we used water to make a path across the lava? Yes! Great idea! We'll let it rise a bit more, and then we'll turn it into obsidian. After that, get ready to run for it! Genius! We'll see. I am so glad I crafted these buckets. I have a feeling my platform's burning! It is. It's all gonna come down, so hop over to my dirt. Okay! Here. Thanks! We could make our way to that hill. Keep in mind, the lava rises every 15 seconds. 
stupid platform! No! <laughs> it's okay. You can have half of my blocks. <laughs> you rock! What should we do? Escape! Look, the lava hasn't completely flooded that area. If we head over there, we might make it. Let's go! Hang on, is it safe? Looks like it! Great! Yeah! Oh, oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, so hot! This is tough! Let's try again! Okay! Let's dive right in! Today, we're holding an underground hideout building competition! Ooh, sounds like fun! Mikey and I will each make our own secret hideout. Then, we'll take turns checking out each other's builds. All right, let's do this! There's just one last thing. What? You see that giant white line? Well, I'm going to build on this side of it, and you can build on the other side. Okay, sure! Our creations are meant to be secret, so... Ta-da! Whoa! This wall will stop us from trying to sneak a peek at each other's work. Great idea! All right, time to get started! So, I should probably get started with a frame. Something like... Hmm... Like this. Yeah, this is a good start. Okay, that should be big enough. Now to lay down the floor of the house. All right, it's wall building time. This is how I like to make them. That's looking pretty good. Now over here, I think I'm gonna put one big window. Yeah, I like it. And I'll put another one over here. Next, I need a bed. I'm thinking this corner here, but the room is looking super empty. I need to add some more furniture. I'll start by putting these in the corner. And how about an anvil over here? And I'm gonna squeeze in a cauldron and fill it with water. Okay, the house is looking great. I think it's finished, which means it's time to get started on the entrance to my underground hideout. Let's do this. Everyone knows that a secret hideout needs a secret entrance. That's why I'm going to hide a lever back here. Hmm, is that good? Hmm. So what I'm thinking is, I'll place the lever here and then cover it up. Hmm, it's perfect. The anvil blocks the view of the lever, but you can still reach it through this little gap. So you hit the lever, and then the crafting table gets pulled under the wall, revealing the secret passage that leads to the underground hideout. This is great. Nice, that does the trick. Now that there's a way in and a way out, I'm gonna start working on the actual hideout. The only thing left to do is design the interior. This isn't a cave though, it's a secret hideout. So I gotta put in some cool stuff like a ton of books which means I need a ton of bookshelves. This bookcase is gonna be huge. All right, now to lay out the bookshelves. It's looking really nice. There, done. Now for down here, I'm thinking I could add some enchanting tables. Oh, and some brewing stands too. Hmm, love it, very classy. I'm gonna need a place to sit. And since I'm going with a gaming chair, why not give myself a gaming laptop too? Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Anyway, now that my self-destruct mechanism is installed, my underground hideout is complete. Let's go up to the surface and find out if Mikey's done building his. You finished, Mikey? Yep. In that case, I'm lowering the wall in three, two, one. Whoa! Ooh. Oh, wow! That looks amazing, JJ. Great job. I made this one, and Mikey made that one. Can we do mine first? Of course we can. Yes. You know what that means. 
what? I'm gonna do everything I can to break into your underground hideout. Don't forget to switch back to survival mode! Oh yeah, right! Let's go! Okay, let the games begin! Hmm? Careful! Keep your guard up! Hmm, it looks like a nice normal house. Hmm, cozy, huh? So, there's a painting, a bed… <gasps> is that diamond armor for me? If you want it, what's mine is yours. You can use anything in the house. Well, thanks. I'll take it. What am I waiting for? I might as well equip it right now. Whoa! It really suits you, JJ! Now what's inside this chest? Why don't you take a look? Don't mind if I do. Oh, apples! That's nice. Yeah, I'll say. There's more stuff in here, so keep looking. Oh, really? Like, behind this painting? <laughs> Good guess, but nope. How about in the furnace? <gasps> An iron! No, a diamond sword! Amazing! Nice find! You're great at this! Hang on! You were supposed to build an underground hideout, not just an ordinary house. There should be a secret entrance somewhere around here, but where? I don't know! <laughs> hey! What are you looking at? Hmm, there's something off about that corner. And Mikey… What? You're acting shifty. I'm not acting shifty. Yes, you are. And that corner you're standing on is a trap door. Huh? What trap door? I didn't notice it at first because it blends in with the rest of the floor. But it's a trap door. You think? Let's find out. I knew it. Oh. Looks like it goes really deep underground, which means it's got to be the entrance to your secret hideout. Yep. Whee! Are you OK? Yeah, I'm fine. Oh, there's water for us to land in so we don't take any fall damage. Hmm, so what do we have here? Huh, it is! And this must be your base! You figured it out! The hole I fell through is your security system. Bingo! Hmm, should have gone with the emerald. Wow, you put in a lot of flowers. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and I've noticed you've also got a computer. Yep. Can you play games on it? Only PC games, but they're so fun! I could play them all day! Is that why you brought them down here? Yep, no one will ever find out! You have a lot of chests! They're treasure chests! They're all empty! I haven't had the time to fill them up with treasure yet! I'll put some rotten flesh inside! What? I don't want that! Hmm. Whatever. Well, looks like that's all there is to see in your underground hideout. Now it's your turn to do some exploring. Are you ready to check mine out? You bet! Let's go! All right, Mikey. Time for you to try out my secret hideout. Wishing you luck, buddy! Whoa! This house is fabulous! I'm gonna go inside, if you don't mind. I went for a modern look. It's really nice on the inside, too! Thanks! What? There's nothing in here! It's, like, practically empty! Seriously, there's no sign of a secret hideout! Did you forget to make one? No, I remembered! The entrance is in here somewhere, but it's very well hidden, so look carefully! Hmm… Is it under the bed? Nope, it's not under the bed! Is it outside? <laughs> no, Mikey. I know it's tricky, but it's inside the house, I swear. Do you want a hint? Hmm. Maybe try looking behind things. <gasps> well, there's nothing behind the furnace. Or the crafting table. Or the cauldron, either. <gasps> Wait! Hmm? There's… there's something behind the anvil. What is that? Oh, you found it! Hmm. Can I pull this lever? Sure. Here goes nothing. It definitely did something, Mikey. Can you find what changed? Huh? <gasps> the crafting table! <laughs> Whoa! It's a secret passage! That's right! And you can push that button if you want to come back up. <laughs> oh, that's so cool! You want to keep moving or… Yeah! Let's see what's down here. Good luck, Mikey. You'll want to keep your guard up for… Uh, never mind. Huh? Oh, it's a door! <laughs> yep. Hmm, should I open it? You told me to keep my guard up, so I'm trying to be careful. I don't want to fall for your traps. <laughs> no, you don't. 
Well, here goes nothing! Hmm? Huh? It seems safe. It's just a big, awesome room! Welcome to my underground hideout! Mmm! Wow! I put in a bookcase and some plants, and I can play games on my computer, too! Hmm! Real nice! Thanks! Oh, what's this? Looks... interesting! Oh! There's a lever inside! Does it do something cool? I bet it does! Well, you can pull the lever if you want, Mikey. But it's really dangerous! Dangerous? Yeah! Are you just saying that? What if it makes treasure rain down? I'll take my chances. I'm gonna pull it! Uh… Three, two, one! Treasure! No, no! Where's the treasure? We have to get out of here, Mikey! Quick, run as fast as you can! Wait! What's going on? You activated the self-destruct mechanism! We have to escape! Ah! Run! Whoops! Hurry! Get back up to the surface! It's all happening so fast! I know, but keep running! Keep running! Okay! Is this far enough? What? Um… Did it not activate? Huh? Hmm. Ah! Let's get started! Today, we're building volcano houses! Volcano houses? That sounds like fun! Alright! How about you and I have a little friendly competition to see who can build the best volcano house? Oh, that's a great idea! I'm gonna get started right away! Oh? <laughs> well then, I'll put some distance between you and me. Mm -hmm. I think I'll build my volcano house over here. Okay, I'm gonna make mine amazing! You won't believe your eyes, JJ! Alright, I better get to work. It's time to build my volcano house. Let's see. With the help of a simple command, right around here, I'll make my own volcano. Like this. Oh, wow! It's creating a crater for the mouth of the volcano. Whoa! Wow, look at it go! This is amazing! Okay, now it's time to turn this pit into a real volcano. For starters, I'll take this entire area and make it rise higher and higher out of the ground. The entire Earth is lifting up! Whoa! It just keeps growing! This is shaping up to be a massive volcano, isn't it? Whoa! The ground keeps on rising! At this rate, the mountain will keep growing forever and ever! Bigger and bigger and bigger! I wonder how big it's gonna get! Whoa! Awesome! Woohoo! <laughs> cool! It's finished! A humongous volcano's been born! It's incredibly big! Alright, I'm at the volcano summit now. Next, I'll make the volcano erupt with molten lava! Hmm, let's see… how should I do it? I have so many options to choose from. Let's use this kind of TNT. All I have to do is set it up. First things first. I should line it all up around the mouth of the volcano. I finished placing the TNT. The device is complete. Alright then, let's make this volcano erupt. Here it comes! 3, 2, 1, go! It's gonna blow! Whoa! Wow! That was amazing! That's a lot of lava pouring out! Wow! There's so much lava coming out of this giant volcano that it's basically covering the entire mountainside! That's incredible! Okay, it's finished. The volcano is complete. Next, I'll turn this thing into a proper volcano house. I'll place the entrance here in the lava. Let's hop in. I'll throw some blocks down around here. Is this a big enough area? There! That should do it. I've created the entrance. Next, I want to make a way to enter this first room. To do that, I'll create an entrance in the ceiling. I'll grab a couple of signs. Now I'll place a couple of these signs along the sides, like this. Now that it's finished, I want to try jumping in for real. Jump right into the lava. And that's how we get inside. There's water directly beneath the lava, so we can immediately put out the flames. Plus, there are slime blocks on the bottom of the entrance room, so you don't hurt yourself when you land. 
All right, I think it's time to get started on the next section. First, I'll punch a hole in the wall. Next, I'll create a space around here. I hope this is a good size. Okay. And done. I'm gonna turn this into a room, so let's make it nice and comfortable. Whoa, now that's a comfy volcano house. Next up, this wall is pretty empty, so let's use paintings to make a secret entrance. I'll clear some space out. Right here. Now to hang a painting. There, just like that. There's a secret entrance behind this painting that leads to another room. So let's make a secret vault. I'll free up some more space in here. There! That's how you make a path that leads upward. So now, at the end of the hallway, I'll place an escape button here. This button is capable of launching you straight to the surface. Let's give it a push. Three, two, one. Click! Whoa! Pretty high! Woohoo! That was awesome! Okay, my volcano house is complete! I wonder if Mikey's finished yet. Let's go see how he's doing. Mikey, are you done yet? Hey, JJ! Check out my volcano house! See? Isn't it great? Whoa! I even hid some treasure inside my volcano house! Why don't we see if you can get your hands on it? Okay, so this is your volcano house. Ta-da! Like it? Mm-hmm. I'll give it a shot. <laughs> hmm. Oh. Well, that's suspicious. Hmm. Huh? Is this your secret entrance, Mikey? What? You found it? Impressive. Really? You fooled me. Yay! I'm gonna head inside. Sure. Go ahead. Three, two, one, open! Here I go! Huh? I'm trapped in a cage! <laughs> huh? Uh, how am I supposed to escape from here? Woohoo! I trapped you once and for all! I succeeded in capturing JJ with my volcano house! Hooray! Hang on, I'll find a way out of here. Hmm, this cage. Ah. Wait, is that a toilet? Maybe. What's wrong with it? Nothing. Really? Try searching more in other places. There's nothing there. It's just a toilet. Let's see. Huh? Hmm. I wonder if I can fit in there. But it's a toilet! <gasps> hmm? Oh, a secret passage! I found it! Huh? Up through here? No way! See? I escaped! Wow! Amazing, JJ! You found the secret passage! Aw, uh, you escaped! I managed to make my way through Mikey's volcano house to get the treasure! Yeah! Nice work, JJ! Next up, it's Mikey's turn to tackle my volcano house! One question, JJ! Why is your volcano house so big? Huh? Well, good luck searching for the entrance. Just try to get inside, Mikey. All right, I'll do my best to find your treasure. Still, I can't believe how big you made this thing, JJ. Cool, right? Yeah, I'll start by looking for the entrance. Good luck finding it. Where could it be? I bet I'll find it easily, though. I'm really good at this kind of thing. I'll find it right away. JJ! JJ! I've searched the volcano from top to bottom, but I can't find the entrance at all! Can you please give me a hint? A hint? Yeah. Your hint is to jump into the lava. Huh? Are you serious? I don't want to get burnt, JJ! It's fine, Mikey. Just trust me. Trust? You? All right, I'll give it a try. Oh, jeepers. Oh, in that case... I'll gather my courage and dive into the lava! You got it! Here goes nothing! Okay, it's now or never! Three, two, one, go! You okay? The entrance! I'm coming! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, Mikey! Slime! 
team! Oh, wow! You're in! Yeah! I'm inside the volcano! I can't believe you made all this, JJ! Mm-hmm! Incredible! All right! Oh, there's a door! Yeah? Hmm? What's it for? Is this part of the entrance, too? All right, JJ, I'm going in! Go ahead! Okay! Wow! There's a room deep inside the volcano! This comfy room was here all along? Yep. Oh, hold up! There's even a computer! And a TV! A sofa, too! Wait, you even have a refrigerator? Wow! That's amazing! <laughs> I wonder what's inside? Take a look! Huh? No way, JJ! This is incredible! What? The big picture? Here? This picture? Hmm. It looks like a normal painting to me, JJ. Hmm. It is an ordinary painting, but try touching it. Touching it? Go ahead. Huh? Will something happen? All right. Three, two, one. Uh. Huh? No way! Nice, Mikey. Oh, is this it? Mikey, you should eat one of your golden apples. Mm. Then we can go. A golden apple? Mm-hmm. These things are delicious! Great. Now, Mikey, come further into the room. Once you push that button, you'll be able to escape. Then you'll be back outside. Huh? Just push this button? Yep. Go ahead. That's too easy. Okay. Here I go. Hmm? Ready? Three, two, one. Click! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! 